Peace be upon you, dear viewers, today I will tell you a story that is stranger than fiction. I hope you like it. Do not forget to support us, and subscribe to the channel, to post more, God willing. In the past in a country, was an old man, who was judged by a strange judgment. He was doomed to starvation. No one was allowed to feed him or visit him. And the old man had a girl whom he loved very much. I begged the governor, to let her visit her father every day. The governor agreed to allow only his daughter to visit him. However, she is not allowed to bring food and drink for her poor father.
Like any girl who loves her father, that girl felt very sad for her father, as she watched him day after day as he weakened his body and weakened his strength. Until that girl decided a strange decision, which made her story an immortal story, recorded throughout history in a wonderful painting. This girl decided to go to her father every day and breastfeed him as if he were her own infant son. This milk was the only thing that kept this old man alive. After a while, the guards and the prison director were astonished by the man's steadfastness throughout this period without eating or drinking according to their knowledge, and not dying. And they realized that someone was helping this man. The director of the prison changed the guard and inspected the man's daughter every day to make sure she was not hiding food or drink that would keep her father alive. But despite it all, the situation remained the same. The prison director decided to monitor the girl himself without anyone noticing. It was a shocking surprise to him and everyone. He saw the girl breastfeeding her father from the milk of her young child, as if she were her small child. And in honor of this girl's love, devotion and loyalty to her father, they released him and immortalized their story in a large canvas. And here ends our story with these two poems. A decent woman, makes a great generation. Do you know that you are good news for us, and that goodness flows here? Do you know that you are the source of life that travels through time, and quenches the world?